Hello, good afternoon, good evening, and good morning. Uh, it's 6 p.m. now in uh, Canada, Point Clare, Canada. It's so uh, friendly, and I am here in my uh, business page, doing Go Live. Uh, I'm, I have a special guest from uh, Melbourne, Melbourne, Australia, a fellow business, uh, uh, business digital business owner from our team. She's soaring high now, and uh, you know her. So excited for her. Her team is uh, growing so fast, and I have her today so she can share her journey with us. And I would like to welcome her on my page. Hi, Liza. Liza from Australia. Hello. How are you, Liza? Kamusta? Good. Yes, mabute. Um, very good because at the moment we're not on lockdown anymore here in Melbourne. Um, so, and maganda ang weather ngayon din. So, um, yeah, it's good. And the business is good too. So, maganda. Yes. That's nice. Nice, 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 nice. Um, that's, that's what the uh, business brings us. Like, all the positivities, all the good news. And, you know, we're helping people. And we're sharing to people, we're encouraging people, and we're inspiring people to take action. You know, yung mga bagay na hindi pa nila na try, hindi pa nila sa subukan. If they wanna change their situation, if they have to, or if they need to, or, or if they intend to, kaya kaya nila gawin din na maging successful. Sa kahit anong bagay, just you know, just have to give it a try. So, Liza, um, I want my our viewers to uh, to know you more so could you please say something about yourself your profession and you know kahit yes. anong, <laughs> pwede mo i-share sa kanila about yourself so um hello everyone wherever you are uh, my name is Liza May Togon so originally I'm from the Philippines Tubong Davao so um Bisaya po so um Good morning, good evening to everyone who is watching um, our go live today and to those followers of Fredeline. Hello. Um, so I am actually a nurse by profession. So um, I worked two years in the Philippines before and then um, I came to Australia um, after I had two years um, nursing background back home in Davao City um, because I have a dreams as well to develop my craft as a nurse. Um, I am also a mom of two beautiful boys 12 years old and four years old and i am a wife to one husband because sometimes i mix it up so two boys and one husband lang po um i am also a nurse working here um at the moment in melbourne um in a government hospital so i am a very busy um working mom as well so before i became a business owner that's my job that's my life as a mom a wife um, a daughter of my parents back home in the Philippines. So it's all about juggling, working here as well. And then became a business owner, which is now add up to my resume. So before I was just a mom, a wife and a nurse. And now I am, a, I am really proud to say that I am a digital um, business owner and entrepreneur, which really adds up a lot of things, good things in our life um, as a family. So, um, I would also say that it's not easy to come in um, an immigrant abroad, but of course, at the end of the day, we have different stories, we have struggles, um, we need to find ways so that we can pass through those struggles. So for me, it's not an easy pathway coming here, but I would say um, with with your passion, with your dreams, you can you can really do it. So yes, oh, that's nice. Your uh, mom of two. We'll have yes. the same there and i also have one husband <laughs> <laughs> yes i have a 12 year old daughter too and i have a seven year old son yeah so it's yes. like we're on the stage of like you know they're turning to another like uh being teenager so now i'm starting to you know to see the yes. difference in my with my daughter it's not a, like a, not a baby anymore she's more Bigger and yes. you know, just our own And being a mom, being a nurse, you like a full time nurse. So you're so busy. How how would how would you run your business? Like 
how much time you spend uh, with your business. So yeah, basically, um, before I really thought that, oh my God, if I'll become a business owner, it's going to be hard for me. I don't want to complicate my life because in the first place, my life is already busy. So why would I add up another? Yes, that because yes. people will be asking like, oh, she's already a nurse. She's just adding a bit of stress, kumbaga, because you yes. need time. Of course, in every business, you really need some time. But for me, what, what is the good thing in this business is you can do it any time of the day. So it won't ask you, just like your usual job, that you need to report 7 to 3, 7 a.m. until 3. And you really need to do that. But in this yeah, in this business, for me, in a day, I would spend, I would say, 2 to 3 hours if I'm working. Um, like, I, with my spare time, before my mindset is I'm doing, you know, Facebook scrolling. And I'm thinking, yeah. I've been scrolling on this Facebook for like 3 to 4 hours, but I'm not earning. Yeah. So... <laughs> Rather than doing that, why not spend it on on this business we, we're in, we can earn an income. So basically, three to four hours in a day or two hours. Um, if you are really, really busy in a day and you can't do, there's an emergency, you know, you don't need to report in the business as well. Yeah. So you can catch up the following day. So um, for me, um, because at the moment, I'm actually on annual leave. I'm on sick leave yeah. because I fractured my foot. <laughs> Oh, so, okay so I had I had a lot of time for the business um at this time, but basically, if you are a busy mom like me, you really don't need a certain time frame that you can spend on this business. Um, yes, that's that's a good thing on this business actually. And the thing is, you in a day just realize you have twenty four hours in a day, so you will sleep like eight hours, so you have still more time. To, to juggle things around. So, yes. Yes. Um, yeah, it's uh, that's the beauty of this one. Like, uh, you know, we set up our business and you just, you don't need to be in the computer like 24-7 to like to wait if you're going to have somebody that will, you know, <laughs> want to do the business yes. with you. It comes with automation. Yes. Not yet. It comes with automation. So, like, you know, it's, Running in the background, whatever you do, you do what you love to do, and you know, you're gonna be surprised. Oh, wow, someone just joined my team! Yeah, that's the exciting yes. feeling. <laughs> it is, it is, yes, surprise. Very exciting. Yeah, yeah. what is your biggest motivation in showing uh, up here for your business every day? Yes, so motivation, it's its always, um that's your weakest link in your life, kumbaga. So for me, it's always my family. So as I've said to you, I have two boys. So they're growing up. So I've just realized when I was growing up, when I was a kid as well, I always saw my mother and father back home working so hard for us. And I said to myself, of course, if I become a parent, as much as I really wanted to enjoy those times with them, because I really believe a happy kid is a successful person in time so you really need to make your kids happy and how would you make them happy is to spend time with them because i always say this one um kids loves to play for us it's like winning lottery like yeah. that's our aim but for kids playing is like winning lottery so if they're young and you're not there to play soccer to play football and they grow they grow so fast um and then by the time that you realize, oh, I miss those milestones um, with these kids. And it will be their memory bank. So when they grow up, um, they couldn't have those mo memories that oh, I play with my mom, I play with my dad. And for me, it's, a, it's the best thing that you can share with your kids. So the first motivation is really for my kids. I did this business because I don't want just to work. Like, yeah. You're not living in this planet just to work and die. <laughs> you know yeah. what I mean? Literally, yes, you really have a lot of opportunities to enjoy life. And if this business gives you that opportunity to be with your kids more as a parent, um, it, it's the best thing that you can invest for, that you can have. Um, so, yeah, I, I, I wake, wake up every day because that's my... Um, it's pushing me to become the better person as a um, as a business owner. Second is actually um, my goals. Um, as I've said, I am really um, a, a believer of goals. If you if you have only dreams and you don't take action on your dreams, it's just a wish. Yeah, it's just a wish, and you keep wishing that one every day. So what's the purpose of um, 
aiming and having goals but you're not taking any action so for me i'm waking up every day motivated because i have a goal that in time i w- i won't work four days it because at the moment i'm working four days in a week as a nurse so yeah. my goal is not to work four days in a work maybe really once once in a week or if i can oh, wow. Like you know, once in a four, that's really my goal. And I know I can achieve that one my because goal. of this business. Yes. First thing as well, if you don't believe that you're going to achieve that, it's not going to be happening. <laughs> so you really need to believe that it will happen. Of course, there's an action that you need to put. But believing on on what you want to happen in your life is very important. So I wake up because I have dreams. Um and those dreams i know i will i will wake up one day that i will have that dreams come true because of this business and lastly last motivation is self growth because it's it's very important for me i am um, at the age of 33 i just realized because i'm 33 now i just realized you you don't need to stop just being a mom being a nurse because you have a full potential if other people in this business can do this yeah I can do to yes, I always think that these people they are weeing, they are pooping, they're hungry, we're the same. <laughs> Pare pareho lang talaga tayo. We're all the same, we're all human. So if if you think um other people are more intelligent than you, then you find ways. What are your what are your strengths? So you right. you shouldn't compare as well, but we are all the same. So it's just a matter of how how you find ways um really to 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 have a self growth and development um and for me in this business i really achieved that self growth as well like yes very before i always tend to complain in life as well hay kulang ang sweldo <laughs> alam mo yun like mauubos lang naman din to the, the salary Mas will bayaran na naman so what i do when i have salary i I actually print screen it. <laughs> Binipicturean <laughs> ko siya. <laughs> Kasi sabi ko, mawawala to in a week. <laughs> mawawala agad. So, for me, it's um, self-growth. So, ngayon, hindi na ako complain ng complain because I know there's a bond. A lot of blessings, you know. Yes. Yeah. Hi, 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 Michelle. Uh, Michelle is watching live from Toronto. She's, a, she's one of our power coaches. Hi, sis Michelle. Thank you for watching. Yes, yes. So that's right. You're right there. You know, uh, we're motivated because you know, uh, for our family, you know, for our self growth. I like that too. And if if others can do it, so like, yes, why can't we do it? Because yeah. me too, I'm very shy before. And then when I saw the ads of my mentor before, I said, oh wow, like if she can, if she can do this, like she doesn't have any um computer background. Not a tech savvy, but now she's wow, really, really soaring so high. And you know, just, wow. <laughs> yeah, I know, like imagining yourself to be in that position in a few years' time, yes, diba? so bakit hindi? So, like now, sabihin na natin na kahit pa pano, we sacrifice a little bit of our time with kasi. We need to, you know, uh, learn the business and do something about the business. But for me, like learning, I'm very, very thankful because, you know, lahat, lahat ng tao, like we have to continuously learning, uh, continuously need to learn, right? So, yes. katulad ng, katulad ng ginagawa natin ngayon, kung, ma, um, kung hindi ka ba nasa business, would you, would you be able to, Oh, I need to learn how to do like an interview. I learned yeah. how to to do this. I learned, <laughs> and you know, and meeting people like see, in sa ang sa ang instances na mamimit kita, I cannot yes. think about it, right. <laughs> You're in Australia. Yeah. You're from Davao. I'm from Laguna. I'm in Canada. So wala tayong like uh, you cannot. I cannot pinpoint any like circumstances that we can meet and we can cross our path. But with this business. Like you know, it's it's always possible to meet people from all over the world. Like hindi lang mga Pilipino. Like yesterday, I have this from UK, which is from other yeah, see, from other countries too. And I'm very very happy that you know we were in this business, and you know the people like us, 
with a mindset like this, like you know, we can achieve whatever we put in in our mind. Yes. Because firstly, like, pareho tayong immigrant, you know. Nung nasa Pilipinas tayo, this is our first first dream to to get out of the Philippines. Because <laughs> alam mo na gusto natin ng magandang buhay para sa pamilya natin. And now that we are that we have a family of our own, we have. We prioritize our family like the kids we're doing this for the kids for the future for our, yes right so we're not wasting time like you know we leverage the social media like you said before um yes. like, sa facebook lang ilang oras mag- anong napapalama, di ba? Wala. so yes. kung may bisa, yeah you it's, it's good like sabi nga nila di ba kung anong kung nagka facebook ka lang din uh, better yet, na kumita ka na, gamitin mo yung Facebook para kumita ka, di ba? So, I just want to shout out, see this uh, uh, amazing lady, hi Uto! She, yeah. Congratulations for your action taker yesterday, I saw it. Wow. <laughs> Thank you, she was, yeah, she was my guest before too. So, like, oh, we I had a connection. Yes. Yes, see? she's uh, yes. amazing. Yeah, she's from Canada too. So, um, Lisa, now that you're saying like the motivation, oh, you should, you uh, told us about your motivation. Um, now what is the biggest impact like of this business in your life? So yeah, um, there's a lot actually to name, but I will just name those things that really have significant um in my life. So the biggest impact, um, of course, uh, mindsetting. I would say in the background of this business, while I'm doing this business, your mindsetting will really evolve, and you will just have um, the positive mindset that you can do anything. It's actually you're not thinking of fear anymore. You're just thinking of faith and taking action every day on how to make your business grow as well. So for me, the mindsetting really changed because. Um, you will be will will be with this amazing people in the community which really really a gift of person for me because these people in the community helps me to become confident to become more um the best version of myself so mindsetting first impact as well second of course we want to be um in reality this has given us a passive income so for me actually it, it gives me um an opportunity that I can earn um, in a different kind of um, leveling sa mindset ko. Kasi before, what I know is just work, just to be an employee, to earn um, a living. But now, the, the best thing that I can put it into words is just you are building your own um, your own business that will really supplement your income in time. Kung baga... Dati, I really thought I couldn't be the CEO of my own business. Now, I can be a CEO because I am the boss of my own business. So that's also the best impact as well. Because before, I didn't know I can create my own business. It's just like, how would you create your own business? I couldn't even know how to run a restaurant, ba? In a traditional business setup, like, you need to hire people. You need to get location. You need to make sure that you're really having um, enough fun as well to run that business. Um, it's a lot of time, effort, and uh, juggling. But um, in this business, you are building slowly as well your own little empire i would say because in time this will really be your backup um it, it doesn't also be like your plan b it can be your plan a because a lot of teammates of ours here are really um soaring high and, um having a lot of blessings just from this business so for me those are the the kind of impact really gives in my life um the mindsetting the people that i just like this at the moment, like we are virtual friends. Kung baga. I just what you said earlier, um that that me in Australia and you're in Canada, how in the world there's no zero percentage that we could meet, yeah. And before this one, guys, I want to share with you as well at the backstage, uh, me and Fred Dillon talk about um our business, and I am learning from her, and that sort of few minutes that you can learn from someone whom you don't know before it's actually it's actually a blessing because it helps your mind oh this um person here is giving some 
like advice or what is she doing on her business and learning is really a gift so it's a blessing so for me the people around this business oh my god it's just amazing you can't complain these yeah. people are just like pushing you to become the better version and in this business you're not going down guys it's always going up yes no there's no going down here yeah yeah, the only thing that you will go down is if is yeah, you quit, you know, you decided to quit, yeah. but it's no quitting at all. Because this business, um, we're uh, doing this is it's not like for a short time of period, like, you know, you yeah. now you're dedicating your time here and, you know, building your um, business. It's for a long time. It's for a lifetime. It's a business for a lifetime. And it's so yeah, um, your kids yeah. as well yeah you can yes that's the beauty of this one so like what you're saying you know the traditional business they need like inventories you know a, a, a big investment money investment but with this kind of business the digital business you don't need that six figure uh, investment six figure um capital to run your own business and to be like the ceo to your own boss yes yes that's the beauty of this one so like with that saying, like with all the businesses, there's always some challenges. When you're just starting this uh, digital business, uh, what are the challenges that you uh, that you find? Yes, I, I would say people always scared when they go into a new pathway. Um, yes, you are scared and it's okay because if your goal is not scaring you, then you should be a bit feeling, oh my God, my goals are just too small. So if you feel scared starting a new venture in your life. For me, starting an online business, of course, I am scared. I am skeptical. I'm human. I'm like you. We are the same. We have like a mind setting of what if I can't do this? But at the end of the day, you always try to win the good thing in you. So if you always let that, I can't, I can't, I can't um, kind of um, um, personality in this business, then you really can't, of course. Yeah. It's always at the end of the day, you're the decision maker of your life. So for me, that's the first struggles that, oh, maybe I can't because I'm not a tech savvy as well. I'm I'm a nurse, yes, but I know how to look after my patient, but not to juggle in the internet. Um, I'm, I'm really not. But with this business, um, I really didn't struggle so much with a tech savvy kind of thing because there's a system that we really follow so um this is a 90 percent done system who who can give you a 90 percent done system for your own business for me that's actually a bonus you it only yes. asks you the 10 percent of course and at the end of the day people would you, you cannot start a business without without giving that 10 percent and it only asks you 10 percent if you still complain to give the 10 percent oh my god that's more than half asking from you yes yeah? so for me i'm not a tech savvy but i was able to to surpass that kind of um challenge because i always says if people find ways in their problems there's always a solution sabi nga nila sa tagalog eh sorry guys i'm i'm talking in our dialect here kung may pinagdadaanan ka pagdaanan mo lang you don't stay in that negative thing if you stay on that i can't feeling hindi mo kaya then you will really stay in that kind of zone. But mm -hmm. kailangan mo siyang pagdaanan lang. So give it like a day. It's okay for you to cry or whatsoever for those negative things. But don't let it run your life for like how many years or how many like, months you shouldn't. Move because on. You won't. Yes, move on. Tama. Um, you need to move on or else you're gonna stop in that kind of life. So for me, I jump into this business because I want to move on into a better level of abundance in life. Second is struggle is time. Of course, as I've told you, I'm a busy mom and a busy working mom. So how can I add up this business into my daily routine? Um, but as I told you, this business doesn't ask you to wake up 5 a.m. in the morning. It's your choice. If if for me, because I'm so happy in this business, I always wake up um, happy and like I always wake up trying to wake up early because I want there there's something in this business that gives us hope. So for me, I wake up with a joyful heart, think um, thinking and believing in myself that. Um, 
my business is really growing each day as I wake up. So I yes. I really tried, minsan nga hindi ka na nakakatulog sa sobrang excited mo. Right. Honestly. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, because <laughs> even you're sleeping on your cell phone or laptop, there's good news from your business. Oh my God, like you can't even tell sometimes I'm just like going to the bathroom after I come out. Oh, my cell phone is saying wow. there's a good news. Wow, yeah. there's... There's a good news. So time is okay. You can you can juggle it around. Um, because if you love what you're doing, you will find time for it. Yeah. Um, and basically for me, that's really it. Tech savvy and finding time. But, yes. Yeah, the the time, uh, you know, management of time. But you know, uh, we all find time if we want to do something. For example, uh, sometimes we we watch TV. We spend time watching TV. Sometimes we stroll. You know, that if you say in the business like you that one hour time it adds up every day, like you know, on on your learning, I think it's enough, you know. Because sabi nga di ba kung may gusto, lagi may paraan. Kung kung ayaw mo, lagi kang may dahilan. So like, yeah. So those are all. Uh, the mentality of us na, na if we want to do something uh, for ourselves, we always find time to do it. We always find resources to do it. Because some people, yes. they uh, like, you know, they want to do something, but there's one thing that's uh, holding their back, them back. For example, yes. their mindset. Or financially, they, they cannot, they said they cannot afford. But what, you know, you say you cannot afford, but if you look into your um, financial, uh, uh, you know, statement or financial whatever you have, you can still you can always find uh, resources. But yes. you're, it's only in our mind, you know. That's the beauty of uh, this business. It's like not only, uh, uh, you know, uh, for our business growth to uh, the personal growth. Like the spiritual, we can have some people like also giving some spiritual, you know, support in the personal growth and the mindset. We can always reach out to people when we're, you know, kind of feeling down because we're only human. It's not always, you're not always on top. You're not always, you know, we rejoice to, for other people's success. But sometimes, you know, it comes to a point that you kind of feel like, uh, you know, it's appointed, appointed because not, in every business, there's always a kind of downside. But as I was saying before, you don't you don't stay on that um, level. You go through it, you learn from it, then you you move on. So on. that's the beauty of yeah. And we learn from some we learn from uh, someone every day. So that's why I, I like to do this like, interview because I meet a lot of people from different walks of life, and it's always giving me some you know, some new pers perspective in that. Like you, like, now that you're saying how busy you are and you still find time to do it, and your mindset has changed and, you, you know, your personal growth, you see how how excited you are in waking up. It's like that before, like, you know, we wake up just to work and then after work, yes. we have to do the mommy duties and everything. But with this business, we, it gives us more excitement. You know, yes. <laughs> to be in the computer to check your, you know, to check the what happened in the team. You know, after of course, uh, even me, even uh, even at work, I still, you know, I'm still thinking about yes. how yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> So that's how we, that's how uh, you know, um, this business impacted our life. It's yes. very, very good, yeah. And I would like to to ask you to, you know, invite people to. Sign up on your um, website, if they, you know, because all of us we started with the webinar. So if people, some people like Artabayan want to also, you know, see what's in our journey, see what's in our community, they can start by watching the webinar. So please, can you invite them and tell something about the webinar? Yes. Yeah, so um, for um, everyone who's watching um, this one. If you don't take action um, wherever you are at the moment and you just stay in your comfort zone, nothing will happen. You will just stay wherever you are. So with me, um, I started this journey um, as an online entrepreneur by watching the free webinar. 
Actually, you don't have any lost in here, guys, because it's a free webinar. It's like we're giving you some freebies. So it's up to you if you will um, get the freebies that we're giving up um, to you. And this is a 90-minute webinar. Guys, you can watch YouTube. You can watch Netflix more than 90 minutes in a day and in your life. And if you spend 90 minutes today or any time of the day just watching this webinar, I would tell you this would change your life because it has been a life-changing journey for me and for Fredeline and for all of us who are having this business. Um, yes, yeah, so our website is actually um, www.lisageo.com. Um, you can reach out to me or you can reach out to Fredeline, whoever you want to reach out in this community. All we want to do is to help you as well because the feeling for me every day, it's like my birthday. Every time I wake up, it's my birthday because I have that kind of feeling that I wake up, I know my business is growing. My business is the hope that me and my husband can have the time freedom in time that we will spend more time. Yes, today we're not having the time freedom because we need to invest time in this business. But in few years from now in few months from now you can have the time freedom and you will really thank yourself that you have watched the webinar in the very first step of your journey and for me if you're not gonna take any step you will just remain on the ground floor so if you want to take uplift your um level of abundance in life because i know abundance is just here all you need yeah. to do is find ways to to, to get the abundance and finding ways is to start watching the webinar um it's a 90 minute um webinar you don't have any loss you don't need it's a free one so um give yourself a gift and that 90 minute can be a gift to yourself thank you Lisa. that's very nice of you um would you uh sa mga kababayan natin uh, you know marami kasi din na mga skeptical pa rin kahit nakikita na nila na oh wow Sa Facebook page nila, sa Facebook news feed nila, maraming mga Pilipina na nag invite sa kanila to sign up and start a business. Pero marami sa kanila yung skeptical. So ano yung magandang advice na maibigay natin sa kanila? Uh, yes. Sa mga gusto rin yun, no? mag-move on, mag-level up, sabi mo nga. Yes, correct. <laughs> move on and level up yeah. because you deserve. All of us, yeah, all of us deserve... Um, better life i do believe not only P filipinos who are in abroad not only nurses um have the abundance in life i believe each one of us whatever you're going through whatever is your work whatever is your age and circumstances in life god wants you i do believe i'm a child of god um if you don't believe god you have the universe the universe wants you to succeed and and you really need to claim that one because if not then nothing will help you in that way and guys mind you not all online business is scam yeah. not all please don't think about that one don't generalize things because if it's scam then not of us here um is having this kind of um abundance in life our teammates has been able to pay a house full okay, our here. team has been able to buy um second property like in canada in australia we have teachers in the philippines and they've been doing this business if you think you, you do your due diligence of course at the end of the day it's gonna be your um um decision but we're not we're you have our names here you have our faces here you can find us um and we are not scammers. Um, look at us. Are we look like scammers? <laughs> no, guys. It's, yeah, it's just a joke. But for me, um, if I didn't take the risk, if I didn't um, did something, um, it's scary. Yes, we do understand. It's a bit scary. It's be skeptical. That's okay. But at the end of the day, no action will be done. Then you will stay where you are. Yeah, that's a you know, powerful, powerful words from Liza. Because you know, you, you can I, I can't even imagine me myself like uh now, like if I don't run this business, what am I doing? Like, you know, just yeah. after right? It's like it's kinda um, you know, become a part of our life, you know, to be uh, dealing with people and you know, engaging with our teammates, engaging with other business owners. And the fun part is for me is like really is learning. Yes. Because um 
you know, it helped us to use, you told before, yeah, to help us to uh, build uh, self confidence and learning new things. And like, uh, uh, you know, you, you don't even know that you can learn that things before. And I now, know. like, yeah. <laughs> we're not yeah. that tech savvy, but you know, with, with the, with the training, the training that we set up, so it helps us a lot. So with this, yes, with this, uh, Lisa, I would like to um, uh, thank you for allowing me to do this interview and to get to know you a little bit more, uh, virtual uh, partner, virtual uh, business partner. And yes. um, I'm very, very thankful to God that, you know, we're in this business and and our uh, founder, uh, Mike and Darren and Leanne, they're, you know, they're very, very supportive. And, you know, they're giving it all away to us. Like, you know, they're very supportive. And the community that they built is, yes. uh, you know, the community is... Uh, it's, it's changing thing. lives. It is, yes. yes. And uh, with the global, uh, you know, with the global uh, changes, so this uh, business is the very, very best business that you can, you know, start right now. Yes. Yeah. So, like, any, any word from you, Lisa, before we say bye to our viewers? So, yes, um, guys, it's pandemic. Pandemic is happening. We don't know in time. Of course, we don't want that another pandemic will come, but we should learn our lesson. And online business, we are online. For those people who are like, oh, I'm not an online person. Um, yes, you're not, but you need to go with the flow. The world is online, so take advantage of it. We are here to help you. We have a system proven, tested, 100%. Um, people are here to hold your hands and walk with you every step of the way. If you want to have the abundance in life, it's always your choice. So this online business has been a big help, blessing to me, to Fredeline, to all of us in the community. And we are doing the go live to share this business with you. Don't take action tomorrow or the next day. Take action <laughs> right now. Thank you, Liza. It's, it's so, you know, it's so much fun learning and sharing your, your journey with, uh, with our uh, viewers. And uh, how do I say it? I'm very, very grateful to you for your time, you know. We you. still uh, squeeze your time to, to do this. Thank you, thank you. And hope you uh, your food is a... Uh, Feeling better. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. And uh, to the to those uh, people who are skeptical, um, yeah, it's your right to be skeptic, but it's also your right to you know do your. Um, it's your responsibility to take action too. If you want to have the abundance in life that you want to, and our, our uh, opportunity is always here. You know, we are here to to help you set up your online business if ever you want it and if you're ever ready. Thank you, thank you so much and have a blessed, yeah, it's Monday already in Australia. Yes. Have a blessed Monday and hear us, it's a blessed Sunday. Thank you so much. Bye for now.